Yo, what's up, crazies? It's me, Crazy Knock, and today we're gonna be looking at a tier list 1v1, and we're gonna go a little bit off Mirror Man's notorious tier list. Everyone's hating on him for this tier list. It's absolutely terrible. It doesn't make any sense. Why isn't Superman at the bottom? Just kidding, we're gonna use it up basis because we like it, but we're gonna modify it right here. We removed, okay, but why would you? And then uh, you're playing a different game. Because I just don't think that's true. What do you mean you're playing a different game? I just thought that's too far. Now let's start with the basics. Let's start with the obvious ones. This will be in order, but not right away. And now we have to think. We have to use our brains. Who do we think of this cheater category? We'll order them in a second here. This is how I feel so far. I do agree with this. I do agree with the ones in here. The tournament winning quality, I agree with those. I think he's crazy for putting Rain Dog at the bottom in ones. That is ridiculous. With Velma and Bugs? That doesn't make any sense. Okay, we're going through, we're going through, and then we're gonna order them. Boom! We're just going through, popping them there. I'm very tempted, but just because he can't use his save, he might be at the top of the S. This is what I'm thinking, guys. This is what I'm thinking. This is what I'm thinking right here. What do you guys think about this so far? Hi! There, it's perfect. In order. It's hard to say, man. It's really hard to say. Crazy dog! Stop being I'm not toxic! toxic. Oh, now we have the order of the cheaters. Superman, yes, he's just his looping and his potential to kill early is what makes him broken. It's not even his grab that makes him broken. Broken. Mm, maybe I'll put Ryan Dog in tournament winning quality. Jake bites is insane. What it's capable of, what are you able to just set up with it is insane. And the stretch and the long punch where you can turn it into a dare or up air and uh, side air. Like, oh, do I go on? Do I go on? Harley, the loops, some of her hitboxes, just the speed and the, what her loops and everything. They're just her presence. Batman, I'm gonna put in the cheaters, honestly. He's extremely fast. His battering is very strong. Not a long cooldown and he has a bomb. He's on the lower end of the cheater, but very high. Morty's potential is insane. Just the grenades and space. And he has a good melee as well. Good melee and projectiles. Tom and Jerry, the Tom, Jerry carries Tom, man. The projectiles are absolutely insane. The cork pops right in my cheeks. So crazy much of them. Knock. Shut Stop up! Get out of here, Crazy Knock, you're stupid. I'm trying to make, Crazy Knock's trying to make a video. Yeah. You're freaking, you leave me alone. Marvin, his button mash combo is insane. Arya, her dagger and combo makes her quite insane. That's really enough said. Wonder Woman, she's up there because she has the speed. She has a speed, might even be above Marvin, honestly. Just the speed alone in her movement. And her armor break is pretty strong. And her armor, she gets the armor ability. Yeah, it's just really good overall. You know what, against Superman, Gizmo doesn't have a chance, but Gizmo is strong, definitely S tier. Plus this teleportation with this freaking, or up special. What do you mean go down the water? Okay, fine. <laughs> Now, Garnet Snare is very strong. This is basically a list showing of what it is like on the post patch, the last patch. Stripe hitbox, just movement, and yeah, just the jab combo. And the gun, man, the gun can really finish kills off. Oh, you'll, you'll see, D-Wall, when you play against good gizmos, it's mainly that teleport, man. He can just loop you in that combo, the foot combo. Rick is hard to play, but is, he's got a huge hitbox as well. And a lot of teleportation. I think his laser is quite annoying. I'm okay with that. I'm okay with this order for the S. Shaggy, I'd say he's at the top. I think LeBron and Shaggy are really close, Steven. He's kind of hard to play and he's kind of quite simple, but he can really set up some really nasty stuff. I think Taz is up there. Yeah, he has lower recovery potential, but if he stays on the stage, he can do some dirty work. Bugs and Rain Dog, just the projectiles and the space they create. I think it's very strong. I think it's very strong. And uh, the freaking dare on Rain Dog is insane. I cannot believe Mirror Man put Bugs Bunny at the tournament winning quality, good and decent. Like, I think he's downplaying Bugs a little bit. I'm not gonna lie. He puts him with Velma in ones. I, I disagree. Iron Giant, just because he has a huge hitbox, it makes him in the good category. Yeah, <clears throat> Steven has some really good, uh, Airplay, yeah. If he plays his shields right, man. And then Velma, she can still be good in ones, just but she signs in twos for sure. Like he's below decent, I don't know. I just don't think anyone's not decent. That's my improved tier list or my personal preference. Is his 
more valuable than my tier list? I don't know, you could say so if you look, depending on the point of view, because he has more tournament experience, he might know fighter games a little bit more. So yeah, you could say that. I just don't think that you can put a tier list above cheaters. That is just insinuating, instead of, you know, aim assists and wall hacks, I'm going above a tier and just like, there's a, I don't even have to play the game at that point. That's what it, that tier means, and I just don't think that's true. That's why I put them all in the cheaters. I don't agree Rick should be in the cheaters list, in my opinion. I will even put him up here, honestly, because he can be very nasty. All you have is your anecdotal evidence and his personal feel. I'm trying to be unbiased. I'm trying to do it from mainly a Superman's point of view because that's who I played, so it's hard to gauge if I can't play every character and go against everyone. W tier list, thank you. That might be a VIP for you, Max. Yep, the Crazy Knox skin for Superman is gonna be top tier. I'd say this is my final ones tier list. We go into the twos. And for Mirror Man, he put this as his twos ratings. And I think he's a... <laughs> he put Superman as the best twos player in the game. See how he says unordered here? That means everything else is ordered. There's just no way that he thinks Superman is the best twos player. Let's kind of copy his uh, layout though. Obviously Black Adam, I think it's just, he's good, he's A, like A is good, you know? Now I'm putting this guy at number one. <laughs> I can't believe he's even this further down the list. Just to save alone, I, I'm telling you, he's the most broken character on the list. I'd say Dom and Jerry is definitely up here. Let's put him in the S's, let's put him in the S's. Cause I'm using his uh, tier list as a guide, I'm not gonna lie. I'd agree with these S pluses, honestly. Getting it, we're gauging it, we're gauging it, huh? It's tough. Hmm, I don't know, man. I think I wanna just delete this tier entirely. I'm gonna have nightmares and my dream is going to be that big guy with the sword hit all the time. Nope, better not hit all the sword with Finn. Wonder Woman in twos. Is it because of her armor? I'm using this as a reference, honestly. I think it's a good list. I think Superman needs to be put in, bruh. No, no way. I do not believe Superman is that good in twos. That he's capable in ones of doing, he just can't do in twos a lot of the time. Maybe day one, yeah, I would agree. If anything, you could put him in the low end. He's broken, we all know that, but everyone's broken in this list, okay, everyone's. That's all, see, I, the reason I'm using this as a reference so much is because I don't, I haven't played twos as much. Take his list, more uh, word for it because uh, my list, you know? I actually might put Rain Dog in plus because his saving ability. I think Arya is lower on twos. That might be true. She can't do her combos as much. Yeah, Tom and Jerry is in freaking insane. Who would it be above? Tom and Jerry is insane with a cork. Jerry carries. I honestly think he's that high. I don't think Carly's better than Tom and Jerry. I'm not gonna lie. Guys, by the way, I got sushi. Sushi. Mm. Mm, 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 mm. <laughs> oh yeah! I'll put him in the bro because of the ice. He's strong. Shaggy, still a strong character. If you uh, have you, if he gets a charge up, that can like really be powerful. I almost want to put him an S for that. Iron Giant with another teammate to help him out. His plus his bolts. He can really get stuff done. If I had to put it in order, it might be like that. I'm not a hundred percent on this order to be honest. But it's the best I can come up with. I don't think. Taz is in his own level. I think that's a little too low. I think this is my final list, guys, for twos, to the best of my knowledge, to the best of my ability. And that's my final answer! If you guys had a problem with it, that's fine. I agree. I mean, I, I agree if you want to have a problem with it. It's really hard to get a tier list. They're always changing. But this is my twos list. And take this with a grain of salt. We did use Mirror Man uh, 2v2 tier list as a reference because we did not usually play twos. We usually played ones, but this is my kind of tier list analyzing all the characters I know. Not perfect. No, absolutely not. But there it is. And then we're going to look at our ones tier list. This is my ones. I do agree. Superman is at the top. And we kind of changed it a little bit. Let me know what you guys think below. Here's also, I did also use mirror man's reference to the ones as well this is his ones tier list and for the most part it's pretty good i lowered it shrunk it down made it more made it more uh better more better all right that's it guys that's it for my tier list hope you guys enjoyed